Oh, you probably wanted me with my arm, huh? I wasn't in your way or something. No, you're fine. Oh, right, well, damn. Adam and Corwin are playing games. They're both so stupid and lame. The show is going to hell. In a handbasket. Hi, everyone. My name is Corwin. This is Adam. You're watching a handbasket game, and we're continuing to play Super Mario Odyssey. And I'm fighting this guy. Yeah, he's fighting the Ramones bunny. I don't know why you name him that, but... Well, look at him. He's, like, wearing the Ramones oh, outfit. And you're covered in his Ramones goo. Is he wearing... Like, I don't... Yeah, wait till you see him in out of it. He looks like he a He looks British. like a fancy lad. And I I feel that that's very Ramonesy. Maybe that's that's just me, but I'm, I'm pretty certain that that is a cultural thing that that bunny is going for. Okay, I might be all over the place here, but were the Ramones British? Because uh, I don't think they were. Uh, and I think you might be thinking of the wrong band. No, which a, would lot make... of, a, lo a lot of those early punk bands were British. Like The Clash was British. Yeah, The Clash was British, but they didn't Name have... Name another uh, one. The Clash, The Ramones. <laughs> I'm pretty sure The Ramones weren't. Um, Audience, help me out here. They're not... Th that's not how time works. Audience, <laughs> just step in... Yes, Corwin, we'd love to help you. Thanks, audience. Who's, uh, can you name another band Damn for it. me? No, go fuck yourself. Yeah, fuck was, you guys, man. That's like, why, that's why time doesn't work this way, Corwin. Damn. Like, I, I could be wrong as well. Like, I am not, I am not, I'm not by any means. In punk. I mean, I like punk, but I'm not proficient in it. Like, I was going to say, I'm not in, by any means, uh, confident in that assertion about the Ramones. Oh, Fuck you, you stupid! Ooh, you rabbit bitch! Damn. Um, sorry, I'm fine. No man, um, if you need to focus on this guy to take him out. You do it. Fucking. I mean, he is ah uh, bunny. He's fucker. pretty. He's fucking a lot of bunnies. Let me tell you. It, this okay here. This his outfit reminds me of the kids from Pink Floyd's uh, Another Brick in the Wall. See, I wasn't thinking that, but I could see that too. Like it's it's the fancy lad. Like a tiny little sailor outfit sort of thing. That's what I mean when I say fancy lad. I should probably be specifying these things. But, yeah. I don't, like... You know what? I, I care enough that we're pausing the episode right now so that I can look up if the Ramones were British. Okay, we're back. They're Looks American. Up. They're American. He wins this round. Yep. Well, no, it's not even that I wanted to be right. It was the fact that... that no, I get it. Like, that doubt would have just... Like haunted me for days. Sometimes, sometimes you just gotta stop. Cat does that all the time when we're watching shows. It, it's never ceases to bug me. We'll be watching the show. She'll immediately be like, "Where do I know that actor from?" And immediately pull up IMDb on her phone and be like, "That actor's from this, this, and this." And I was like, "That's cool." So I like to know what the character's doing though. The Can, way the way that everyone watches TV. Then that's is that is that just a is that nor is that not normal for everybody? Whoops. Wow, you just fucked yourself there. Oh, I, you're no, you're uh, making me question felt, my watching habits. I felt the so. normal way that people watch shows is they watch them. Yeah, no, like, it's, you, you're you able, like, multitasking is a thing. Eh. And, mm. well, and it's one of those where if I don't get an answer to stuff like that, then it just weighs on my brain... And I can't focus on the on the uh, the show because well, I'm so busy, woo, trying to figure out, you know, why why do I know this guy from season three of Scrubs? That's one of the ways that you and Cat are birds of a feather, and I get that. That's you guys, but, bird feathers. And that's just not a me thing. I uh, that's weird. I, I get into the characters, and I'm watching the show, and. Stuff weighs too I don't heavily. Want distractions, like I like I, I recognize. But here's the thing, though, I actually am normally really good. Like normally, I can tell Cat where she knows them from before she looks it up. Yeah. So maybe that's Shit. why it doesn't bother me. Is because I just. Oh, you're just that good. I, I, I honestly, yeah, I honestly am. I'll watch a show. I'm just so and fucking I impressive. I will recognize. Like uh, here's an oh, example. Fuck. Have you watched uh, Stranger Things uh, two yet? Uh, yes. I have. Yes, All I have. Right. Well, all right, spoilers for anyone who hasn't seen it. Go ahead and fast forward a second or five. I'll, I'll throw up a time code on the screen when I'm editing so that you can avoid spoilers. The guy who was the good doctor, turned out to be the good doctor. Uh, yeah, Paul Reiser. Was, yeah, the guy who was in uh, the Aliens movies. Yeah. I called him immediately, and Cat was just like, who's that guy from? And I'm like, I, this guy hasn't been on the screen in like 20 plus years, but 
I know exactly who he is the moment I saw him. Yeah, see, I, uh, I clocked him from the credits. Uh, and so I was just, like, waiting for... Oh, hey, look, there's a secret moon back there. Mm, go get it. Uh, oh, uh, spoiler over, Adam. Uh, <laughs> it wasn't really a spoiler. Exactly. But anyway, yeah, really. um... I clocked him from the credits and then was waiting for him to pop up. And then when he did, I'm just like, holy shit, that is Paul Reiser. Yeah. He has not been in many things lately. Nope, has not. And also he aged like he aged surprisingly well. Yeah. Mind you, I, like he, he looks like he did like 20 years ago, but with gray hair. I don't know if that says, I don't know. If that says more about how he looked 20 years ago or how he looks now. Well, so but... let's get because I liked his characters and because I like the guy's work, I'm going to go ahead and say that, that whatever one means better. Okay. Well, that was one of those where, uh, like, it, like you just did, uh, when people are talking about Paul Reiser, they're just like, oh, yeah, from Aliens. I saw Mad About You <laughs> long before I, like, I used to watch Mad About You with my mom. So I knew him from that. Mm. As opposed to aliens. And I'm just like, yeah, yeah, from aliens. Mm -mm. Mm. I'm not a nerd. Mm -hmm. You're a nerd. But oh, now like, I have to like, I'm, this I'm again. normally pretty good at just seeing someone and being like, that's from... Like, and the thing is, because I like, I really like... I'm, I'm a part of the culture that likes to watch shows over movies frequently. Like, I love movies. Mm -hmm. I get it really into movies. But I think that television writing has gotten significantly better over the last nope. like many years. Nope. So mistakes, mistakes were fuck. Wow. Fine. So um, I can just leave. I don't know why. Well, maybe I have to. I want no. I don't have to go forward. This is gonna leave me out. I'm leaving. <laughs> fuck you, cave. But so I really get into the television. Can, yeah. Can you only get out? No, you can go that way. All right. Yeah. No, I'm good. Um, don't don't you worry your pretty really little head good. about the game. I got this. <laughs> they've got really good stories and they're really well written these days so i find a lot of stuff i just really get into so i see a lot of characters who play small bits here and there yeah and uh i'm bad with names so i never remember the actors names i just remember their face and what i saw them in and frequently what the characters their name was yeah in that um see where i always run into problems is when it's like he was in one episode of these seven different procedural shows that you watch each so like you know him but you have no idea who he is because he was in, like he was a bit part in eight different things. So it's just like, yes, you absolutely recognize him, but you don't actually know him from things. Mm -hmm. You just know his face. I don't know what you're going to do there. I Can you? I think I might be going backwards. I, yes, I'm definitely going backwards. Okay. Don't worry your pretty little head about the game. <laughs> I got this. Clearly. <laughs> that looks cool. Yeah, it is. It's another very cool mechanic. A little fork chef. Yep. Th that bird up there showed up out of nowhere and took about over steak. our stew pot. Just when we were making more of our special stupendous stew, too. Everyone was getting ready to dig in. Yep. Well, Sorry, they can't. Because they're dead now. Because of the giant bird. And their deaths. Oh, God. What do you want? Yeah, really dark there. Climbing the mountain used to be a piece of cake, but now the path through a scoop probably blah, 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 blah. I'm a fork. There's no way up there now, not unless you can sprout it wings or hitch a ride with a flappy type. Flappy type, that's uh, what's on my on my Tinder profile. I'm looking for a flappy type. Oh, see me, it's uh it's the type of font that I use. <laughs> it's just it's all different shapes of flappy bird. Oh. Formed into uh, formed into letters. <laughs> what a horrible font. Yep, it's not good. I'm ashamed of it. Why can I not jump straight you up? You know what I used to do when I was like in sixth grade? Yes. I would. All right. <laughs> I would write out something like really long, and then I would use the font or whatever changer, and I would change it into another language. So I would all of a sudden it would be in Japanese caricatures or something. Characters? The characters. <laughs> caricatures. <laughs> and um, I know words. See, you say caricatures, and I can't think of what a Japanese caricature would look like without it looking just horribly racist. Yeah. Like, just just saying. But anyway. I would, um, but I would I would do that, and then I would tell other kids, like, yeah, no, I speak this language here. Look, I can read it. And I would, I would, I already know what it says because I wrote it, so I would say it. And then they'd be like, really? Wow, that's really cool. And I convince people I had different languages all the time. Kids are dumb. 
And you, like, you're just a hooligan. I really a am. Hooligan a hooligan slash con artist slash, like, well, I mean, like, worst con artist ever because that's not particularly clever. Yeah, I didn't but do evil stuff. It works stuff. on children. I just did dumb no, stuff. No, you did evil stuff. Remember the old woman that you swindled out of her only money? <sighs> you stole yeah. her food and she died gasping for air because that's that what too. happens when you starve to death. I went in and I was like, give me all your air. <laughs> just well, left her she, there in an airless room. She was actually on oxygen at that point, <laughs> so you just took her oxygen tank to get high because you're a delinquent. <laughs> I wish I could... Oh, I can. I was just like, I wish I could swim faster. Oh, if I hold this button I'm down, I'm really I glad I didn't faster. discover drugs until I was an adult. Yeah, that's really... That is a good thing for you <laughs> because... You'd have. I would be dead now. I was just about to say you'd be in a lot worse shape. <laughs> oh boy. We oh we hope that got scary. <laughs> we hope. Yellow Mister Fork. Uh oh, this that's looks neat. That's something that I have seen recently that apparently is not an everywhere thing. Hmm. Uh, like when you're surprised by something, or like when you're just like reacting to something, going oh. Apparently that's a Midwest thing, and like. It, it doesn't happen everywhere, and it's confusing to me to think that it's just like, well, what do you do? Huh. Like, uh, I mean, Facebook has told me this, so it may or may not be accurate. Mm. But, you know, that's that's what I have uh, that's what I have gleaned lately. It's like you bump into somebody. Oh, sorry about that. Mm. What, like, what does, does you read? What other places do or other cultures Apparently, do? Apparently, other places... Well, not even other... Like, I mean, kind of other cultures because they're different parts of... There would be a second moon in there. I'm going to find it. Mm -hmm. um, different parts of this country, they would just say, Oh, I'm sorry. Or, I'm sorry, I bumped into you. As opposed to going, Oh! 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 oh, 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 oh Gundam oh, style! Oh, oh, boop, boop, boop. There's some Whoa. interesting... Th oh, shit. There are some interesting things that are done differently. Like, um... I was just talking to a friend of mine about this. This is a little horrifying, but, like, out west, when I'm out uh, near South Dakota, in South Dakota and other states in that area, they, uh, if someone dies in a car accident... Yeah, you told you, okay. you told this story on an episode, actually. Okay. It was during an Amar I well, think that, it was during a Mario episode. Okay, well, yeah, but that was just an example of that's just something really crazy, but, uh, is a thing that they do, uh, do in other places that they don't do here. Here... Yeah. We buy a stuffed bear and a bunch of flowers, and you, we put it in that spot, and it what? lasts until the rain washes it away. And that's really how we get rid of it. It seems that it sits there until the rain washes it away. I'm pretty sure road crews take care of it. Well, they do a shit job, because that stuff gets hideous before they actually, like, clean it up. I I don't know enough about stars to... Oh, there we are. There's... Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's Clearly, like... we know where we're from. There is there is a Google program right now that can just tell us exactly where we live. No! Not just because the old internet will say so, but because we're gonna just no! die, just let it happen. Ah! Just, just let it happen, Adam. There oh, embrace my death. Okay, on the next episode, I'm gonna get that moon for realsies this time. We sure hope so. Oh, what do you guys think is our favorite lantern color from the Green Lantern, Blackest Night, you know, all the different colors of lanterns in the uh, the lantern, lantern cores? Uh, answer down below. We'll record the right answers and give shoutouts to people. Get it right. Give us game suggestions down there as well, and we will try to play them. If you like our stuff, subscribe to the channel, and if you have friends who would like it, please share the videos around. Bye, guys. Pimples suck.